Jim Hood refuting claims late this evening that he's trailing in the polls. That Mason Dixon poll did reveal that 9% of those who were asked are still undecided. Both candidates acknowledging today they're well aware of how close this race is. But our poll numbers are showing that we're at 46, 42. Uh, either one of them probably within the margin of error. It's the fact of the matter is the only poll that matters is the poll that comes out on election day. The latest Mason-Dixon poll does show Tay Reeves in the lead by a margin of 46 to 43 percent. Nine percent are undecided. Breaking down the numbers by race, 80 percent of African Americans said they backed Hood. White voters polled 66 percent for Reeves, 24 percent for Hood. Both candidates slamming away Wednesday at the other's proposals. We don't need any more taxes. We just need to go back and get what money he has got out in contracts, all those private prisons and all these examples of where our money has gone. Well, my view is if he'll lie to you about his desire to raise taxes, what won't he lie to you about? Less than two weeks until Election Day, and both candidates say they know it is going to be down to the wire. It's going to be a very close race, and we will hope to get our vote out. We hope people realize how important this election is. This race is going to be close. It's going to be a close race. What's going to decide the outcome is who actually goes to the polls and vote. So much can impact voter outcome and turnout. For example, weather. Uh, four years ago, the voter turnout in the state was 40 percent for what many consider a more contested race. Eight years ago, the turnout numbers were around 49 percent. Live at the state capitol, Scott Simmons, 16 WAPT News.